We own this system on top of the Natural History Museum of Utah. It consists of 330 kilowatts DC, and that amounts to about 291 kilowatts AC output. It generates over 400,000 kilowatt hours a year. That amounts to about 25% of this building's overall load through the course of a year. Uh, it was a very challenging project to build given the many different roof levels, no two of which except on the third floor share the same level plane. The project was a long time coming together and a lot of people worked hard to bring it there. One group that uh, sometimes doesn't get the credit they deserve is Utah Clean Energy. The policies in our Public Service Commission, our regulatory community, have not been all that uh, favorable to renewable energy projects, but uh, thanks to the work of Utah Clean Energy, that has changed and it continues to change. We had 40 to 60 partners that helped us do that because Utah Clean Energy doesn't do any of this alone. We do it with our community partners and our business partners because sound energy policy can surmount the politics of energy. And so we really look for policies that make sense for Utah and move those forward. I also want to thank uh, Hunt Electric, who's an electrical contractor, Oakland Construction, who's a general contractor on this project. We started the Renewable Energy Branch at Hunt Electric about four years ago and since then have employed over 30 students. We're very appreciative for Utah Clean Energy that help us set the regulations. It provides a very good showcase for renewable energy in the state of Utah. I thank all of our community partners and business partners for working with us and standing by us while we drive smart energy policies and get away from the politics.